Fix this disk is unreadable when playing a game on Xbox 360 Solution 1, check that your Xbox profile is the same one used to purchase the game. 1. On your Xbox 360 console, go to Social, and then select Sign In or Out. 2. Select your profile to sign in. 3. Scroll right to Settings and then select Profile. 4. Select Edit Profile. 5. Select Gamer Tag. Recheck the gamer tag you entered. If you're using a Windows 10 computer, see more info at http colon slash slash support dot xbox dot com slash n hyphen us slash my hyphen account slash manage hyphen gamer tag hyphen and hyphen profile slash change hyphen xbox hyphen live hyphen gamer tag. Solution 2, transfer the game's original license to your console. Note, you can only transfer a license once every four months. 1. On your new console, Sign into your Microsoft account using the Xbox profile used to purchase the game. 2. Go to Settings, and then select Account. 3. Under your billing options, select License Transfer. Refer to the below image. Follow the instructions to transfer the content licenses. After you transfer the licenses, download the content again to update the local licenses. For information about how to do this, See how to redownload previously downloaded or purchased content to your Xbox 360 at http colon slash slash support dot xbox dot com slash n hyphen us slash xbox hyphen 360 slash store slash redownload hyphen content. Or, review the methods below. Method 1, view your download history on the Xbox 360. Method 2, view your download history on the Xbox Live website. Other profiles can now use this content on your console. You can also use the content when you are not connected to Xbox Live. If you do not see the content you downloaded, contact Xbox support at http colon slash slash support dot xbox dot com slash n hyphen us slash contact hyphen us. Solution 3, see the Xbox 360 disk drive solution if your Xbox 360 console can't play a disk, or if the disk drive is stuck in an open or closed position, you've come to the right place. Tell us which type of Xbox 360 console you have and which specific type of error you're getting, and we'll walk you through some steps to try to correct the problem. If you're unable to fix the problem yourself, you may consider sending your device to Xbox support. See details at http colon slash com slash n hyphen us slash xbox hyphen 360 slash console slash disk hyphen drive hyphen solution. Solution 4, delete and reinstall the game 1. Select settings, and then select system. Refer to the below image. 2. Select storage, and then select your own storage device. 3. Select games and apps, and then select the games on demand game that doesn't play. Note download the size info. 4. Select the games on demand game, and then select delete. 5. Go to the game store and download a game demo or other content that is approximately the same size as the games on demand title. 6. Press the guide button on your controller. Seven. Select Settings, and then select Account. 8. Select Download History. 9. Select the Games on Demand game, and then select Download again. 10. Once it's downloaded, try playing the Games on Demand game. Other Voices, 1. Repair the disc you're trying to play. 2. Send your Xbox to Microsoft so you can get the lens fixed safely. 3. Clear all of cache on your device. To clear your cache, Navigate to the My Xbox channel in the dashboard menu, within which you can select System Settings. Select Memory, highlight the HDD, and press Y. Select Clear System Cache, then Yes. 4. Remove the hard drive from your Xbox. If the game starts with the hard drive removed, then power off the console, remove the hard drive, reinsert the hard drive and after try the game again. If it doesn't work only with the hard drive attached, then your hard drive will need to be replaced. Alternatively, try to use a USB flash drive. To do that, you first configure the flash drive, download your profile onto that drive later. 5. Removing any other memory units or USB flash drives from your Xbox. If removing one of these resolves the issue, then power down the console and try again with the drive reattached. If the game doesn't work only with the device in question attached, it will have to be replaced, or if it's a USB, back up the data in it, and consider reformatting it later. 6. Try a different game disk or media. If a different game disk works, the first slash problematic disk will need to be replaced. 
If other game discs also do not work, you'll want to check your warranty status and set up a repair.